Introducing first, she is the challenger. Gonna man down the fort right now is Booker T having to deal with the breaking developments here going on at Christmas Chaos, but nevertheless, now the former reality of wrestling Diamond Division champion Roxy walks out under the stars here in Texas City, Texas, looking to regain what she still feels is rightfully hers. She is the longest reigning Diamonds champion in history. She is the youngest champion in reality of wrestling history, and tonight, her guaranteed contracted rematch against the new champ. Well, Promise Braxton is saging down the reality of wrestling nation like she's Kyrie Irving at the TD Garden. Nevertheless, she is the new champion. You see the title around her waist. You see the confidence on her face. Promise Braxton walking into the new year feeling good. What's up, Mark? For many of you who've watched reality of wrestling, for the years that I have been calling the action on the desk, you know when it comes to title matches involving new champions, when it comes to the first defense of a new title, I always say the same thing. And it always holds true. It's one thing to win the title, it's another to defend it. Here we are. The opening bell has sounded at the World Gym Arena, Booker T World Gym Arena, here under the stars, deep in the heart of Texas. And there's collar elbow tie up. Promise Braxton getting the upper hand. Now a wrist lock there from Roxy, the now challenger for the title. Promise Braxton, I guess, still has her mask on. <laughs> Afraid, perhaps, of the road nation. You saw her saging them down. Side headlock here. Oh, beautiful takeover from the champion. Head scissors there by Roxy back in a controlling position. Roxy using the strength in her lower body to keep Promise Braxton down. Promise Braxton finding a way out of it, wiggling through, looking for early pin, cover one, Whoa. kick out by Roxy. Here we go again, Roxy, head full of steam. Still reeling from that championship loss. There we go, Roxy, a curtsy almost. A little smack talk to the new champion. Promise Braxton has to be careful here. It's very easy to have that championship level confidence cover one, kick out after one. It's easy to have that championship level confidence when you win the title. That's a huge monumental occasion is what you get into this industry for to be a champion. Promise Braxton has accomplished that. She has been able to get that done. However, you cannot let that confidence turn into cocky. And that is what she is on the borderline of already doing in her young and early career and championship run. Another collar elbow tie up. Promise Braxton, the taller of the two competitors using that leverage and now some right hands. Roxy returning with some forearms, still playing by the rules. These two ladies going at it though, here at the World Gym Arena. Oh wait a minute, the referee having just break it up and what was that? A rake to the eyes from the ch from the champion to the challenger. A rake to the eyes to get the advantage. I'm sure Booker was still here calling the action with me. He'd say, well, you know, Bradley, if you ain't cheating, you ain't trying. But I'm sure he doesn't appreciate that in a title match like this. Oh, my goodness. A slap to the face that sent the feelings of Promise Braxton somewhere near Des Moines, Iowa. What a fantastic slap there from Roxy. And now one, two, two, two. Oh man, I thought she might've had it right there. We might've had a new champion after that. Sometimes when you slap the taste out of somebody's mouth, 
you completely throw them off of their game plan. It's the old adage by Mike Tyson that has been overquoted, but I'm going to do it anyway. Everyone has a plan till they get punched in the face. And Roxy, again, using the power in her lower body. Those legs are so powerful of Roxy sending Promise Braxton into the turnbuckle and then those double knees. Double knees to the grill. Cover. One, two. Kick out after two. Roxy, oh, working on that left arm of Promise Braxton. Snapping it so hard she got brought Promise Braxton to her knees. Good reversal there from the champion, head full of steam. Roxy had it scouted again, but I think Promise Braxton this time, oh my goodness. Promise Braxton shifting her weight forward, sending Roxy right into the cover. One, two, tight cover. Sent Roxy into that middle turnbuckle. The Bret Hart rope, as some people have called it. And now sending her face right into that second turnbuckle. Thank the Lord it has the pad on it. Nevertheless, you are feeling the effects of the inertia and force of your forehead. Oh, going right in. Oh, to a steel buckle. Cover, one, two, kick out after one from Roxy. Promise Braxton gonna have to do a hell of a lot more than she's doing right now if she plans on keeping the former Diamonds Division champion down. Looking for a reverse neck breaker, hits it. But look at that, dusting off her hands. She's not going for the cover. This is not how you retain a championship. This is not how you have a long title reign by having a nonchalant attitude to a competitor the caliber of Roxy, no matter if you're in the driver's seat or not. And just disrespect there. Disrespect. From Promise Braxton. <laughs> Draping Roxy's neck under the bottom rope. Cover one, two, and a kick out from Roxy again. Coming up gasping for air. Promise Braxton shaking her head almost in disbelief, but we should believe it. Roxy has been the most fighting champion in reality of wrestling's recent history. Oh! Promise Braxton had it scouted and a big boot right to the grill of Roxy. And now Promise here looking for what? She's looking for a figure four. Inside cradle, one, two, and a kick out. Looking for that Enzigiri. Oh, look at that beautiful maneuver. Very innovative offense. Now going for a cover, one, two, and a kick out. And you see Promise Braxton took that one second, that one second to acknowledge the crowd, to taunt the crowd, to, to give herself props. That one second could have been the difference between that two count and that three count. Well, here comes a surfboard. Oh, look at that, just rearing back on the chin of Rock C. You see the back extending, hyper extending of the back and the neck, the chin being tugged away at. Rock C finding a way to fight out of it. Promise Braxton in my vantage point here is still in the driver's seat. The champion trying to get the challenger in the up and look at that. Roxy with a beautiful reversal using her lower center of gravity to bring Promise Braxton into that second buckle. Head full of steam hitting the top buckle. This might be Roxy's opportunity. Oh, chop to the chest and another one. Oh. Those forearms are coming from Roxy, but not with as much force as they were before. You could tell this match is really having, having taken a toll on the former champion. Head scissor into a Russian leg sweep. Cover one, two, hooks both legs, kick out after two.
And you can see the look on Roxy's face right there. She knew that was her moment. That was her opportunity. Go for that big Harlem sidekick almost. Spinning heel kick into a beautiful German suplex. Shoulder was up. Cover. One, two, and a kick out again from Roxy. These two women, without a doubt, showing everything that they got in the center of that squared circle. Oh, beautiful! One, two, king out after two from the destroyer from Roxy. A modified destroyer right there gets her only two and a half. And the former champion now having to dig deep as she is illustrating the injuries from this encounter. Roxy, what is she doing? Oh, swing and a miss from the former champion. And Promise smells blood in the water. Cover one, two, three. That's it. That's it. Promise Braxton retains. Promise Braxton retains after the miscalculation from the former champion, Roxy. By any means necessary, Promise Braxton walks out of her first title defense. Still, the reality of wrestling Diamonds Division Champion here at Christmas Chaos. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. As the champion began to celebrate, I know that music, and there she is. There she is, AQA, the former Reality of Wrestling Diamonds champion herself. AQA has been sidelined out of action with an injury for what feels like more than 12 months, a full calendar year. And she is using this opportunity right now here at the Theater Under the Stars in Texas City to call her shot against the rising newcomer. AQA, Thomas Braxton. Could this be the match that we are seeing here in the very near future for that reality of wrestling Diamonds Division Championship as the smack is being talked in the middle of that squared circle. AQA looking to be in tremendous shape. But nevertheless, Thomas Braxton walks out. Our biggest event of the year, still, reality of wrestling, Diamonds Division Champion.